I'm at 3900 Lake Crest Terrace, Middleburg, Florida, doing a roof inspection. It is uh, March 4th, approximately 1230, and you have wind damage. So everywhere you see a line, this shingle has come loose, and as the wind flaps it, you can see the crease line right there. That's as good as a missing shingle because as it continues to flap, where you see the parentheses is where a shingle's missing. Here's a corner. This whole section, I think it was, yeah, this whole section lifts up. So that's how it must have got underneath it. Tore it right here. It tore it right here. And there's a crease line right there. Another crease. Two more here. Not on this little slope right here. On the front side, you have a corner crease again. Full crease. Corner crease. Corner crease. And that whole section up here. Got lifted up right on the front side and you can see when I when I go like this, you can see right where it buckles, right here. And you can see the crease line. One right here, they all lift, they all lift up where your satellite is. There was none on the front. That's okay. You see the crease right there. As you continue to flap, you get your missing shingle. There appears to be a missing shingle right there. see the black line right there corner of your ridge cap came off on the pool side they're scattered around Corner. Creased up at the top. A little harder to see with the black shingles, but if you're up here, you'd see it clearly. Crease. Corner crease. Corner crease, missing shingle. So that's as it became creased, and then the winds kept flapping. Corner crease, it just gets loose and loose until it rips off. This one is right up top, which is harder to see without the sun out, but it's there. So my professional opinion, you have 25 plus wind damage shingles, like to help you file a wind and hail insurance claim, get out and show you how we get this done.